Over the Labor Day weekend, President Trump held a somewhat impromptu 45-minute news conference on the north portico of the White House, at which he took questions from members of the White House press corps. I happened to hear most of it. Here are the things that struck me. First, many of the reporters who asked questions of the president weren't asking questions at all. They were engaging in debate. I've been listening to presidential pressers for a long time. Contentiousness between the press and the president is par for the course. But not like this. The personal disdain that these people have for this president is palpable. They make no effort whatsoever to hide their feelings. In four decades in this business, I've never seen anything like it. Second, despite the foregoing, I'm struck by the fact that Donald Trump makes himself available for questions from the media more than any president in recent memory. He almost never boards or disembarks from Marine One without holding a micro press conference. It's to his credit. And that leads to the third thing. There is no way that the media would treat Joe Biden the way they treat President Trump. A Joe Biden presser would be softball city. And that assumes that Biden would even hold a presser in the first place. That's my word. What's yours? Go to youtellmetexas.com and you tell me. And follow me on Twitter at Paul Gleiser.